Hey everyone, welcome back to Out and About. My name is Stuart and Misty is walking behind me. And today, yeah, there she is. Say hi. Hi. All right, today we are in beautiful Amherst, Nova Scotia. It's a Thursday. Yes, we are, uh, uh, well, Missy's not. I am taking a day away from the office. We're here in Amherst, gonna meet some friends for breakfast, and then we're gonna to tour around this beautiful old city. Well, not old city, but the city in Nova Scotia and check out some of the architecture because there's some pretty cool looking stuff here. And we'll take some uh, shots of downtown Amherst for you as we're out and about here in uh, Nova Scotia today. All right, first things first, I'm hungry and I need to get some food. So we're gonna go into Brittany's here and uh, meet up some friends uh, for breakfast this morning. Well, late, late breakfast, early lunch. All right, everyone, so breakfast is done with our friends. We had about, what, 30, 20 or 30 people that we know missing come out for breakfast this morning here in uh, Amherst. Now we're gonna walk around and have a look at some of the uh, pretty cool architecture here. Maybe we'll do a little bit of narration about uh, the history of Amherst while we're uh, taking some shots. But yeah, it's a pretty uh, pretty nice day here in Nova Scotia for uh, for June. It's, at least the weather's uh, come back to being somewhat normal, eh, Missy? Yeah. All right, let's go uh, check things out. All right, everyone, welcome to Amherst, Nova Scotia. Misty and I were very fortunate today to visit with some military colleagues of ours that we served with back in our day of being in the Canadian military. We got a chance to walk around town, check out some old architecture, lots of great, like, red color buildings. Here's the Dominion Public Building, dating back to 1935. It was a beautiful sunny day. I think the temperature was like 22 degrees. So we got to go to the park, surround this blue chair. Missy got a chance to go in it. We both sat down for a bit and I got to act silly and, you know, just wave to all our fans from out the boat. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe while you're here. Yeah, you see the red masonry of the buildings. It's fantastic. I haven't been anywhere really where I've seen a lot of this, uh, this color brick and stone. It's, uh, Pretty unique to this area. All right, so we're uh, wandering around here. Pointless wandering. Remember, Missy, when we did the pointless wandering theme on our channel? Yeah. We did the pointless wandering around Sumpner Landing in the villages. We went pointless wandering in Savannah, Georgia. Now, we're pointless wandering in Amherst, Nova Scotia. We've stepped it up in the world a little bit from the villages to Savannah now here in Amherst and we're just pointless wandering today. Yeah, baby. It's good yeah. to pointless wander. Can we get chubbies? Can we get chubby? Why don't you gonna show us what a chubby is? Oh, oh yeah. There's someone behind you. <laughs> Ooh, they have blue. Blueberry bass. Can I have a chubby? <laughs> You can have a chubby if you want. All right, so we stopped at the uh, Maritime Tartan Company right behind us here. Got a salsa Nova Scotia magnet. We're all, uh, we got we got our magnet for the fridge. So uh, we have mem a memory of coming to Amherst today, Missy. Got our, yeah. got our magnet. So what is this, Missy? I don't know. <laughs> I just can't make this one stop. I saw those, just these paintings in the other store over there. So Missy found this uh, little antique shop, clothing shop, all kinds of things here. So she's out looking around and I'm gonna see what else is here and uh, maybe we'll pick up uh, some, some, some art finally for the house. So I think the name of this place is called Doyle's Department Store. That's what's on the uh, on the door anyway. So we're gonna go with that as the name of the uh, the name of the store. But there's all kinds of little shops called the Tree Bo the Copper Tree Boutique, Maritime Mosaic, uh, Electric Kitty, a few little places here. Dales, not Doyle's. Dales, D A Y L E S. Dales. Did you find anything? No.
So some uh, pretty cool things to see. Mm -hmm. Dale's Department Store, that's the name of this place. All right, let's go see what else is in this funky town to see and do today. All right, so we crossed the road and uh, walked down the other side of the street. I think this is Victoria Street that we're on right now. Got a good view of the buildings from the other side of the road. Uh, here's the Maritime Tartan Company again that we were in. We got the Magnet, the Royal Bank of Canada. All right, so here's some information about Amherst you may or may not be aware of. Amherst, the town was settled in 1764 by immigrants from Yorkshire and England following the expulsion of the Acadians. Doesn't she look thrilled? The original settlement was about a mile and a half from where it is today. And these settlers from Yorkshire were joined by United Emperor Loyalists, AKA the Loyalists, who fled the United States during the American Revolution. They built a mill where the city and town is today and everybody packed up and moved closer to the mill. So there's a little bit of history about Amherst you may or may not be aware of. Hope you found this information useful. And let's get back to our journey, checking out this World War I, World War II Memorial. All right, so I'm standing in front of the uh, War Memorial for World War I. Of all the people from, uh, let's see, make sure I get this right, Cumberland County here in Nova Scotia. So World War I uh, Memorial here. Got a all the names of everybody who uh, who served or perished uh, during that uh, great conflict from 1914 to 1918. So yeah, so nice uh, tribute to uh, the, Cana uh, the Canadian involvement, but also the Cumberland County involvement uh, here in Nova Scotia. The one below is the Second World War. I don't know if you caught that. As I stand corrected, Missy also pointed out all the names below are from the uh, Second World War. So these names here are all key players in Canada's Confederation. So I was pretty interested to find that out. And those red stones, well, they date back to 1889. Pretty cool. So this is the courthouse here. Uh, dates back to 1888. 54 Victoria Street here in Amherst. Or 1888, this is the uh, courthouse. So a lot of the buildings on this uh, downtown stretch are all historical places here in Canada. So. It's good to see them preserving just a bit of history instead of having all these glass and steel structures. This is, uh, is kind of nice. All right, so we're just on our way home. We're gonna stop here at the Nova Scotia Welcome Center and uh, check out some of their souvenirs before we head back into New Brunswick. Just, uh, it's a nice day, so why not take a little bit of a stroll and uh, see some things that we don't get to normally see in our hustle and bustle everyday life. All right, so I had a quick little stop here at the tourism place here at the New Brunswick, Nova Scotia border. On our way home, Missy picked up a t-shirt and got a few things. Hey, anyway, we're gonna head back to New Brunswick now. We gotta get back on with the regular part of our day. So uh, we will uh, see you guys in the next video. I'm Stuart, Missy's over there somewhere. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you in a future video from wherever. I think we're going to Fish and Chips tomorrow back in Booktouche. So watch for that video. We'll see you later, everyone.